The vote we're taking on these bills today is undeniably necessary. As good stewards for Michigan families throughout Michigan, I'm thankful that we have found common ground in advancing solutions to ensure our taxpayers will not fall victim to Trump's alleged tax reforms. If we're honest in this body, we're covering for a guy that spends more time tweeting than reading or leading. I'm certain that this tax cleanup bill gives my colleagues across the aisle something that they can hang their hats on after rallying behind this egregious tax reforms that Trump and his members in the Republican Party in Congress pushed through. Representative, I respectfully ask that you keep your comments germane to the legislation at hand. Chair recognizes Representative Gay Dagnogo. Thank you, Mr. Speaker. We all know that the federal tax cuts and job acts, Michigan taxpayers' families will actually lose their ability to claim exemptions if we don't make this fix. They won't have their dependent exemptions beginning tax year 2018 if we don't make this fix, because this hurts families. If it were not for a bipartisan fix, it would have cost Michigan, ta Michigan taxpayers an estimated $1.5 billion and additional income taxes every year due to their inability to have these personal and dependent exemptions. I only wish that we could use this body to fix the rest of the mess that's coming from Washington. It's been cutting 40% out of our core government programs. It ends student loan forgiveness for public service. What will we say to our interns or teachers that my colleague just talked about? It cuts Head Start. It cuts education and boosts private schools. It cuts... Representative, I'm going to respectfully ask that you keep your comments germane to the legislation before us. The chair recognizes Representative Gay Dagnogo. Thank you. The, the tax be, bill, bill before us really addresses the tax reform package of which all of these elements have been cuts that are a part of that tax reform package. And we should not uh, cover up the fact that it cuts Section 8. It covers the Environmental Protection Agency. It cuts broadband energy and water. It privatizes federal... Representative, you are out of order.